Welcome to the Ogles channel. Thanks for watching today. And let's talk about defeat the decaying uh, Ixikes. I'm that's probably pronouncing it horribly wrong, but this dragon in Elden Ring. And this is one of the first dragons in the open world that you can't just completely cheese by poisoning with poison mist from behind. And so for this dragon, I recommend uh, immediately going in and approaching him, getting one free hit in like this, and then heading directly over this little rock structure and behind this little um, fungus you have here. And once you're here, you can just sort of uh, set up base for a little while. He will shoot some uh, rotten breath at you, and he won't be able to hit you from this distance uh, at the moment. And you're just going to keep waiting here until he approaches and gets basically all the way to the edge of the rock formation that you're hiding behind. And you'll know when he approaches because he opens his mouth a little bit and then he'll take sort of a run at the area and he gets sort of stuck there. Now once he's there, he's going to basically just keep trying to attack you with his wings. And he's not going to really try to attack much with his um, rotten breath. And so while he's standing here doing this, you're just going to simply keep standing there and throwing your fireballs, your spells at him, continually lowering his health. If he does end up trying to shoot you with his rotten breath, I do recommend getting off this and just jumping off to the left and then jumping back up here as soon as the uh, rotten breath is gone and then continue to pelt him with your spells. Now, when he gets down about two thirds of his health, he will let go of this massive rotten breath attack. And you have to, when you see him getting ready to do this, you have to get out of there. And I mean, get on the horse and just go as far away as fast as possible. And I mean, far away because it kills everything in its uh, area and once it sort of dissipates then you're going to come back get back into the exact same spot and do the same strategy again pelt him with your spells and just simply if he tries to use his um, rotten breath jump off and then jump back to the area now you can continue this strategy until he gets all the way down to about a third of his health and then he'll let out yet another massive rotten breath cloud and you have to once again get out of there Get on the horse and go as far away as you possibly can until it dissipates. Then come back and get back in this exact same little location, the spot. And once again, pelt him with your spells or with your fireballs uh, from this area. If he shoots out his uh, rotten breath and smaller attacks, jump off to the left or jump off to the behind just for a second and then jump back. He won't do any more of his massive rotten breath um, spews, I guess as you would call it. Um, he only does that when he reaches the thirds and the two thirds mark. And so you should be fine just simply standing here, throwing your spells and jumping off with the smaller rotten breath um, attacks and jumping right back. But this is the easiest way that I know to defeat this boss. I couldn't find a complete cheese strategy for this guy, or I couldn't think of one rather, but this is pretty much foolproof as long as you follow these instructions and you'll defeat him probably first try doing it this way. But if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe to the channel. Check out my other Elden Ring cheese videos up above. As always, go out there, find a great game to play, and just simply have a great rest of the day.